Piggy lives with his owner Tom and Pita almost two years now in the city. They adopted Piggy from Tom's mom. Tom's mom lives in a farm. Piggy loves living with Tom and Pita in the city. Piggy is the only pet they have. So all their attention to Piggy. Every day they take Piggy to have a walk in the park. Come on, Piggy, we have evening walk. Piggy starts to moving her tail, sign that she's happy. But the situation changed. Tom had a job promotion, so he always busy with his job. And Peter got a new job where it's more far from their apartment. They are always coming late when coming to the apartment. They don't have time to play and even the evening walk with Piggy anymore. Oh, they are very busy every day now. I feel lonely and I'm so bored. Just stay in this apartment? I think they don't love me anymore. Piggy started to think if she live in the farm with Grandma, maybe she will be not bored because she has a lot of friends there. Penny the chicken. Sonny the dog, and many more. To take her owner attention, Piggy start to make something that makes her owner angry. She made a mess of apartment. When her owner finished working and back to the apartment, they were surprised how dirty and messy the apartment is. Clothes everywhere, all pig food spread on the floor, Owner was very angry to Piggy. Piggy, what are you doing? When we were at work, what happened to you? You used to not look like this. Piggy was silent and think what he had done. I am so sorry. I am just bored. You all forgot about me. You are both not loving me anymore. Toma Pita started arguing about Piggy. They blame each other not to teach Piggy right way. After they into a big fight, they realize that they don't have time for Piggy. They are too busy with their work. In Sunday morning, Tom got a phone call from his mom in the farm. Good morning, mom. Good morning, Tom. How are you? I am fine, Mom. What about you? Hope you are well, too. Not really, Tom. My ankle was hurt yesterday. I cannot walk, and the doctor said it will take a month to get recovered. I don't know who will take care of the farm. Tom and Peter have a long discussion about moving to the farm before Tom's mom called. Tom thought his mom is old to take care of a big farm. And they also thinking about Piggy is better living in the farm. So it is not suitable for Piggy. They decided to move to the farm next month. After everything packed and say goodbye to the neighbors, they are ready to go start a new life in the farm. Piggy oinked at Tom and Pita. She said, thank you for bringing me to the farm. Now I can meet my friends. Piggy is so happy because she can now have a big yard that she can go around and play with other animals. Penny the chicken, Cappy the caterpillar, and Sunny the dog. Okay guys, that's it for Piggy the Lonely Pig. I hope you enjoyed. Bye!